So if you're into 3D printing, you definitely know what these are. For anyone who's new, these are your typical wire cutters, sometimes called clippers, snippers, or pliers. But since we mainly use them for filament, let's just call them filament cutters. Chances are, if you've bought a 3D printer, you've received a pair bundled in the box, especially from brands like Creality, Soval, or similar manufacturers. And if you're like me, you've probably got a few pairs lying around, which honestly isn't a bad thing because you can never have too many filament cutters. But why bother? Why make a video about something as mundane as mass-produced filament cutters? Well, on this channel, I love using 3D printing to improve everyday objects, solve small but annoying problems, and just make things better. If you lose or break these cutters, they're easily replaced for next to nothing on AliExpress. But here's the thing. Over time, the rubber handles wear out, exposing metal beneath, making them uncomfortable to use. Occasionally, the handles even come off completely, taking the little spring that makes them pop open properly with them. And once that's gone, you might as well toss them. But hang on a second. Is that really necessary? Or can we 3D print a solution, one that not only prolongs their lifespan but actually upgrades them? Yes, we can. These 3D printed handles significantly improve the original design. By embedding magnets inside, we use magnetism to replicate the lost spring mechanism. You know how magnets attract opposites, right? Well, reverse the polarity and they push apart, exactly the behavior we want for filament cutters. For anyone not interested in magnets, there's a non-magnetic handle version too. Links to both designs and the magnets are in the description below. Bonus feature. Thanks to the magnets, these cutters now easily snap onto any magnetic surface. No more cluttered workspace. Before wrapping up, I just want to quickly thank everyone who subscribed. Three months ago, I was excited to have 10 subscribers, and now there are 250 of you, which is amazing. I'll do my best to bring you videos as often as I can, featuring practical 3D prints, cool designs, and occasional tutorials based on your questions. If you're not subscribed yet, feel free to hit the button below. Thanks so much for watching, and as always, happy printing.